The Jason Eck era has officially begun in Moscow. The new head coach looking to get the Vandals back to winning with his new offense and an axe. I was really pleased with his effort all day and uh, expected big things from his senior year. Nate DeGraw, where you at? Yeah. So I think it brings out people being like, I want to work harder today so I can I can get that recognition and it's kind of kind of like a, a badge of honor almost. So it's kind of it brings it more more energy and more attitude to the locker room. Spring ball actually day one uh, coach brought it out and I was like, oh, yeah, let's rock with that. I love that. The Axe Man, an honor handed out daily at Vandals practice to the hardest working player, earning bragging rights for the daily winner. Are Definitely. you going to be walking around with it today, show it off? Probably. I might bring it down to lunch if I, if I can get it from him. The Axe, a symbol of a good practice, but also symbolic of the new Eck regime. I feel like compared to last year, it's definitely a lot more excitement. Um, just the want to be out here and want to come get better. It was definitely a big change from last year. I mean, it's just a good overall feeling. Uh, it's a lot different. There's a lot more energy around the players. Guys are more excited to come to practice, more energized while at practice. Guys are excited to see how we how we play together in this new program. A big part of the changes come on the offensive side of the ball. X spent the last three years as the offensive coordinator at South Dakota State, where the Jackrabbits had the eighth highest scoring offense in the FCS. He brings that same system to Moscow. Well, I think they have a pretty good feel for the offense and. You know, our, our style is we don't have a lot of new plays every week. We have the same plays that we just dress up. We run them out of different formations, different personnel groups, different motions. So I think there's a lot to keep building up. And, uh, I could not ask for more as far as the effort, uh, the focus, how they're trying to do what we're asking of them. And that's been, even from when I first got here in the winter, uh, we haven't had any resistance. I think we have a lot of great kids who, who want to be good, and, and we just got to keep showing them the way. Idaho's first game of the season, an exciting one for us here in the Inland Northwest. The Battle of the Palouse returns to the football field for the first time since 2016. The Vandals headed out to Pullman to take on Washington State on September 3rd. Reporting from the Kibbe Dome, Travis Green, Crim2 Sports.